starting in 1997, so this is the seventh meeting we've organized. The meeting was originally, and as far as I'm concerned, still is organized for the students. What I totally enjoy out of this is interacting with the students and teaching the students, also meeting with my colleagues. Uh, it's a wonderful opportunity to get together with your professional colleagues. ISF's conference uh, during the entire period since it was established grew tremendously and during the conference 2011 we have approximately 500 participants from altogether 45 countries and what makes me really happy this year conference really had more students than ever we are talking almost 200 students either from the United States from Europe particularly Croatia in the future I would like to see basically many many students from all around the world coming to Croatia and to being part of this I would say very unique conference because we are covering molecular medicine, forensic anthropology and forensic genetics. Boga moli Pivajući kamenu i drači Kroacijo kamater te voli Umorna si ali mi ne plači Sve ću pisme pokloniti tebi All this kali around from the world We get together Besides the former meeting, in the informal setting, we exchange knowledge, we exchange experience, we exchange the friendship. It's a wonderful meeting. I hope this meeting continue to grow, not only for the DNA scientists. We should be including other, such as police officer, detective, judges, prosecutor, and educator. This conference is uh, special interesting for me as a clinician because uh, we have uh, lots of lectures and lots of speakers who are actually medical doctors. So we had interesting uh, lectures about uh, myocardial infarction and use of the uh, genetics in repairment in the uh, myocardial infarction and uh, especially interesting for me is prenatal di diagnostics whole section about prenatal diagnostics and hopefully uh, in future we will have more and more lectures like this <laughs> Such 
začo. Nemoj si ne nikud ići, tvoj je kamen maslina. Just this meeting uh, at Penn State University, we decided to increase our level of interaction with the folks here in Croatia, and uh, one of our vice rectors was here to sign a letter of intent uh, that is going to uh, allow for uh, interactions across all different types of disciplines, engineering, architecture, kinesiology, and including forensic science between Penn State and the university system here in Croatia. Well, we're hoping to do a lot of things between now and two years from now, um, but certainly we'll be here in two years because, and I think this, the size of this meeting is an indication that people now around the world see the, the value of the structure of this type of a meeting, which is uh, more interactive, uh, it's more about student learning, student teaching, uh, rather than just a conference where people come and give talks. Uh, and we'll just continue our relationship and continue to do hopefully some fun things, possibly uh, online teaching where we can teach classes from the United States in the classroom here in Croatia and vice versa. I think that I'm a living example of how ISAPs could be very efficient because my very first conference was in 2001 and I was there like a student. So 10 years later I'm invited speaker for the last three times. Basically I'm very happy with this conference, uh, not only because of, my, because of myself that I heard very interesting thing, but also because of a lot of my students that they had the chance to be here and uh, listen to all these wonderful people, leading scientists in the world in forensic science, molecular anthropology and any other scientific field. I'm actually uh, one of the, um, the, the few people here who isn't a scientist. I'm actually an attorney, and I'm the former director of the National Commission on the Future of DNA Evidence for the United States Department of Justice. And what I do now is I consult internationally with countries around the world on the integration of DNA technology into criminal justice systems. And the reason that I'm here at the conference um, is to talk about that issue and integrating the technology into the legal system, particularly, particularly in the context of forensic DNA databases, arrestee databases, convicted offender databases, because if we talk about the value of DNA, we talk about the value of genetics from an investigative standpoint that really comes together most importantly in the context of databasing and allowing police to solve crime more quickly and more efficiently. So that's kind of the subject matter of my talk. And, and in terms of what I'd like to see in the future for this important meeting, and, and to be clear, this is the only meeting that really brings together forensics and anthropology and, and um, uh, molecular uh, genetics uh, in a way that really promotes collaborations. Um, when we're finished here, we, we don't go back to our offices uh, and, and simply remember what we did and what we saw here. We go back and we have continuing relationships with people that we've met and we've collaborated with here and that's really one of the most important things and so what I'd like to see in the future is is I'd like to see um, more investigators more frontline investigators I'd like to see more attorneys more prosecutors um, attend this meeting because there's a tremendous amount that they can get out of it even though it's fair to say much of it w would be above their heads scientifically. Um, there are a lot of issues that are addressed here, uh, and there are a lot of very important people here that, uh, that prosecutors and investigators could really benefit in, in, uh, in, in developing relationships with.
svake noći za te Boga moli Pivajući kamenu i drači Kroacijo kamater te voli Umorna si ali mi ne plači Sve ću pisme pokloniti tebi Sve džardine neka mi te kite Kroacijo iz duše te ljubi ja te volim kaj imati dite, Kroacijo iz duše te ljubi. The purpose of the meeting has always been the education of students, and I think the purpose needs to continue. Uh, I'm not sure where we will be, where the meeting will be in two years. Uh, I'm hoping it will be in Croatia. And one of the nicest things is we've moved from September to June, where the weather's much better. Let's play Twister, let's play Risk. See you in heaven if you make the list Yeah, 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 yeah Now when did you hear about this one? Tell me are you locked in the bunch? Angry are you goofing on Elvis? Hey baby Marvelous and touch If you believe That put the man on the moon Walking with a staff of wood Yeah, 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 yeah Newton got beamed by the apple good Yeah, 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 yeah Egypt was troubled by the horrible last Yeah, 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 yeah Mr. Charles Darwin had the gall to ask I really look forward to the next meeting in two years where I think lots of new developments in genetics technology and our legal aspects will be discussed at the meeting, hopefully somewhere back here in Croatia. We will try to put more and more students in our conferences, so we will make like a medical school, summer school or something like that, so we can teach more students because they are really interested in genetics, and hopefully uh, I will do my gynecological part in that conference in the next two years. Here's a little legend for the never-believer 
yeah, 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 yeah. Here's a little ghost for the offering. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now here's a truck stop instead of St. Peter's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mr. Andy Kaufman's gone wrestling bears. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, Wendy, did you hear about this one? Tell me, are you locked in the punch? Andy, are you goofing on Elvis? Hey, baby. Lovables and touch. If you believe that put a man on the moon. The moon. If you believe there's nothing up my sleeve, nothing is good. I would like to thank for outstanding speakers that are coming from all the world. I would like to thank for the organizers, including Mayo Clinic, Penn State University, University of New Haven, and Croatian universities as well. And it makes me very happy to tell you that this conference is having extremely important role in the field of molecular medicine and forensic genetics. But also it makes me happy to tell you that Croatian Medical Journal that is dedicated to, for this conference is very well known and very well recognized and respected. And finally, my wish is that ISAP's conference in the future is going to be the conference that every single person that is in the field of forensic genetics or in the field of molecular medicine, but linked with the following topics, will be part of this conference. And also, I really hope that most of the students from the medical school or the students that enter in forensics program will be also part of this conference. And eventually I would like to see all the friends, people together. I would like to share the knowledge. I would like to share the possibilities, capacities. And eventually I'm sure the new generation of forensic scientists as well as the new generation of the, of the people involved in forensic anthropology or people involved in forensic genetics will meet together, will make the future together. And ISAPS is just a great place to be. So thank you so much.